Pretty. This is Hey y'all, oh my god. Strong and courageous. Do not be frightened and do not be dismayed. For the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. Joshua 1, 9. Hey y'all, welcome back to another day in a life. Y'all, I need my nails done ASAP. Did y'all see my nails? Y'all, has life been life and for anybody else? Like, life has been life me. And in this vlog, I'm going to show you guys just a day in my life as a wig maker. I am just cleaning up my little office space really quick. The first thing that I always do is clean up so that I can make sure everything is organized and clean before I start. Like, I cannot start working until everything is spotless. So now I'm setting up my utensils, my sewing machine, and then here are Hey, y'all. Welcome back bundles. to another vlog. You guys saw me just organize my little desk area. It looks so much better. I only can start working with a clean space. So here's the package that I'm about to open up. The wig that I'm making today is a deep, I mean, kinky curly wig. Why did I order? Wow, I realized I folded, guys. I folded with this order. So with my kinky curly units, all I need is two bundles. Two bundles goes a long way with the kinky curly hair, but I got three. So it's okay. I'm just going to order more hair to make an extra one on the side. And then it comes with a free hairnet that I'm just going to put in my client's order. The first thing that we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and bleach the knots. This is a 4x4 four four transparent lace closure from my hair company. Look how pretty this thing is, y'all. And then when I comb it out, y'all's gonna be so cool. It's pre plucked. You barely see the knot, but I'm gonna go ahead and bleach the knots. You really don't need to bleach the knots with my hair for me, but I bleach it anyway because I want the most scalp like look as possible. So, and it's already, it already has the baby hairs. It's pre plucked. Like, I'm excited, guys. So, I'm gonna go ahead and bleach the knots. You guys can watch me as I do. Okay. after bleaching my knots i found me something to do y'all um i'm over here fixing the lash of this mannequin that i brought from key nicole on instagram y'all i absolutely love this mannequin this is the best mannequin that i've ever had and the best investment i've made for my business y'all like it makes my content and quality of my work looks top tier here is what the knots look like after bleaching we're gonna wash that out y'all now i am about to print out the shipping label now for whatever reason y'all my laptop stopped working on me so i called my brother to help me with this shipping process it worked for his computer his, his is newer than mine i had my laptop for over seven years y'all it's been a it's been a minute but it's time for a new laptop y'all i washed out the bleach and then i let that dry then i started the foundation of the wig process here y'all i am just listening to music vibing and just sewing the hair onto the cap y'all i literally just take my time during this moment and you know think about life and vibe and just do what i gotta do y'all i cannot wait for this to be like every day you know what i mean like for today i only had one order i'm so grateful for that and you know i just took my time with this order and i was rushing y'all to get this way complete because i was supposed to go out with my friends y'all but I had to make sure my work get done before play. You know what I mean? I always make sure my work get done before I go have fun. So I was trying to rush in. Well, not really rush in. I still took my time to make sure everything was on point. But um, I was supposed to go out with friends, y'all. Just to find out. Y'all going to see later in this vlog what happened. It's too funny. But y'all, do y'all see the backdrop, y'all? The backdrop is falling to pieces. I need to get more. Uh, oh, y'all, look how neat it is. Y'all, I'm done. 
I have to get more mountain tape to um, put more on those pieces because it's not strong enough. I'm using my wax stick, y'all, to get the wig nice and flat, y'all. Link in the description. Thisnatchcollection.com. That is where you can get the best wax stick you'll ever get your hands on, y'all. And then I hot comb my wig like a million times, and I like to use my hands, too. And then uh, make sure you brush out your units every single time you're done sewing them on a sewing machine, y'all, because, because you're cutting wefts, you're going to get some, I guess you can call it shedding, but it's not really shedding. It's because you're cutting wefts. You're always going to get some pieces that fall out. It's just... It's just the way it is, y'all. But it's not going to create shedding over time. It's only going to create shedding for that moment, if that makes sense. So make sure that you moisturize the hair. I use water and mousse. I'm plucking, styling. I'm doing my favorite part, y'all. This is honestly my favorite part. I always say that. And on my TikToks, my reels, every single, I feel like every single YouTube video, I say that I love styling, y'all. Because it's like can't nobody style like you like your hands is your hands you know what i mean like it's just i i'm so grateful god blessed my hands and i can slay a mother loving wig y'all so i used some makeup to define the part now i'm going to put it on my mannequin to take pictures y'all and this is like the final result it looks so good Here I go, pressing the unit for the millionth time, y'all. You just got to make sure your wig is on flat, flat, y'all. So this is where I package the unit, y'all. I have a million videos showing how I like to package my units. Very cute and a nice purple box with a lot of goodies and a hammer and note, y'all. And this is my going out outfit, y'all. I ended up changing, but that's another story. So here I am putting in a polymer, adding on the label, and I'm ready to go, y'all. So these are the final results. I hope you guys enjoyed this. This is the process of wig making. This texture is so damn pretty. This is our Malaysian Kinky Curly. It's so full, y'all. It's only two bundles, and it's a 16-inch. Hey y'all, so I was rushing to get out of the house, y'all. And I realized, let me slow down. So I was I'ma do my makeup in the car and everything, y'all. My skin is so dry because of this weather. It's cold. So I'm gonna do my makeup in the car. Y'all watch me do it real quick. It's gonna be like a 10 minute beat. And I don't know if I'm still going out anymore, y'all. Cause I had to make sure the work got done first. But I'm gonna let y'all know. Y'all will see. So if I don't go out, I'ma just have my makeup done just because. And I might go out with myself somewhere. We'll see. <laughs> A minute before I pulled up, I was like, oh my god, it's MLK Day. I don't think the post office is open. It's it's Martin Luther King Day, y'all. The post office is not open. So we're going to ship the order tomorrow. No biggie. First thing in the morning, I'm going to ship the order out. It's no biggie, y'all. So now I'm about to go about my day. And at least I got the order done, but I'm about to go about my day and have fun. All right, y'all, so I made it to uh, Huey Magoo's. I think I'm saying it right. It's a chicken tender place. Out here. I've been wanting to try it for the longest, and I'm here. Y'all can see it actually back there. So today was a little hectic, so let me let me back up for a little bit. So I was trying to do my makeup in the car. It didn't work out, y'all. Y'all didn't really get the footage. Did my makeup, you know, rushing to go to the post office so I could make it out to the first spot we were supposed to go to with my friends almost i pull up to the post office and then i remember it's martin luther king day it's not open so i'm just gonna ship that tomorrow and then in terms of meeting up with my friend i wanted to see like what the vibe is like before i drive out there because we were all supposed to drive together 
so she called me like girl we never went and i'm like wow see i'm rushing and doing all this for nothing so she's out there right now trying to figure out what she want to do next i'm over here trying to get some food so we might end up meeting later we might not either way this is pretty much my day y'all we having a good time i'm okay day chilling i'm about to eat y'all i'm excited i cannot wait i love me some chicken tenders so i'm gonna let you guys know how it tastes all right y'all i got my food it looks pretty good let me see if it's any different from any other places that i've been to i tried a fry already the fry is pretty good this is what it look like y'all it is giving very basic so far but let's see what it tastes like they have a huey magoo sauce that i'm gonna try with but first i got the oh by the way i got the five piece tenders i'm gonna try it without the sauce first oh mm, the juice of the tender just burned my titty y'all oh my god all right let me try it with the sauce mm. oh that is y'all mm. it's like mayo and ketchup that's all that really is. It tastes good though. Um, I prefer like barbecue sauce or ketchup. Fries are good, tenders are good. Let me try the toast next. The workers are chilling outside, y'all. Okay, let me try the toast. It's good, y'all. Everything is pretty basic. There's nothing too spectacular about this meal. But let me go home and F it up, y'all. <clears throat> I'm gonna make my way home. Ooh! Can we get into this sunset, y'all? Oh my goodness. Wow. <laughs> The following day. 